Hey everybody, this is Shago, and hopefully I'll be finishing out Bit Sonic 1 today because this is the last level, these are the last areas in the game. Skybase! This is actually dark, which is why the rings are all blue, and then the, when the electric traps activate, they turn like the normal golden colour. Those cannons there will hurt you. So wait until after they launch the load. And then go after them. Ah, oh, shit. I got completely lost here, so. That shield would be nice right now. Ah! Right, watch the electric because that hurts as well. Boom, 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 boom. The cans will always attack you in like four, hit, four bolts before stopping for a while, so that's so you know the pattern. I don't think there's anything down there of interest, so. And you can't really jump this or be not, and he doesn't shoot his thing back at you. Oh yeah, I forget. This this is the reason why I got lost because that buddy had been out there and I was thinking maybe I should jump over him and turns out you don't actually need to jump over him. You could just run under him. Let this flash first before I jump on the platform. Jump on this platform here. Yeah. If you're not on the platform, it'll stop and wait for you. Which is what you need to do. Oh wait, there's nothing up there. I forget. Or is there? Oh wait, yeah there is. This is how we get to the end of level. I'm trying not to fall off because that's bad. And we're on Robotnik's Egg Blimp or Sky Fortress or whatever it's called in this game. Egg Carrier? Eh, why not? It was called that in the other Sonic games. Well, it was Wing Fortress in Sonic 2, but still. Now we're on Sky Base at 2, we're on a blimp. Because Eggman is a big fat blimp. Ooh, I went there. Now to get the case emerald here, uh, don't go the normal route. You'll see a platform just underneath the life monitor there. Just grab onto it. I hate going the normal route anyway. I've died too many times to the normal route that I just won't go through the normal route anymore. The music on this level is actually quite good. I quite like the music on this level. Have you jumped that one there? I think there's an extra life. And with some skill you can get back onto a platform. I can't reach that. I can't reach that, no. I sense failure because I think I need to go for that one. Yeah, I think I need to go for that one. I'm going to have to kill myself. Yay! I think you need to get to the one at the top, so. Yeah, you can sound you look grumpy and impatient though. You can stay on that until we sat find the other one. Basically, jump on these platforms until you get to the other side and then 
the emeralds are right there in front of you. Going the normal route, you cannot get the chaos emeralds. Okay, there's the chaos emerald. Just watch it for the cannon. There's a cannon there that will shoot bullets. Kind of reminds me of a doom shit from Mario 3, only you can't kill the bullets. Ah. Go through here. Run to the right. This one, for some weird reason, always gives you a ring, but it kind of helps as soon as you've not actually got any rings. Fourteen lives. All the emeralds. I think that should be sufficient. The sky base at three. Remember, no rings. You might die. But yeah, it's just a straight line to the boss, basically. Having a shield here really, really helps. But just start, jump, and get two cheap hits, and wait where I am like right now until the electric thing has gone past. Just don't just make a quick run for it. Make sure you jump the energy ball. I think if you're quick enough, you can actually get two cheap hits on him though. Oh, and the final boss is actually different in the Game Gear version, but... I've never actually been able to beat the Game Gear version for some weird reason. Oh, you're going to do something different now, aren't you? That's what your different thing is, you zap us when you feel like it. This might actually take more than one video. Then take two cheap hits before the electric thing gets you. As soon as it stops, get another hit in. Just go for one because you might just get hit by the zapper when you get there. All the energy ball. You're gonna wait for me this time, aren't you? Shh, damn it! <sighs> don't tell me I'm gonna use save states here. I don't want to use save states. Alright, you do it at timed intervals. So now you can actually get more than one hit on him. Because he's just going to go straight after you. Time this right. I think he's only on the last hit anyway, so... There we go. Eggman runs away again, chasing after the fastest thing alive. And he gets away. Too bad for you, Sonic. But don't just sit there, jump in. And here's the ending. The good ending. <laughs> Silly egg man. You should watch for falling hedgehogs. You might want to turn the volume down here.
And it's removed that black cloud of Red Mans and that's it. Now it's just going to tot up the final scores, chaos emeralds, how many continues I've got and stuff like that. Uh, that's it really. I also like the credits theme for this as well so I might just shut up for that or just make a new video. Um, I don't know what my next let's play is going to be for after this so I'll do one when I feel like it. So until next let's play, I might actually just put the credits in another video so anyway. It stopped to uh, totaling scores up four seven four three hundred. That's not bad. But till my next let's play, or until you finish watching the site three. Ciao.